So the distinction for single whip in terms of the foot adjustment, the right foot adjustment, when the whip happens, when the crane's beak happens, the desire is to have the foot at a 45 degree angle before you express your on here. Okay, so the question is, at what point does the back foot adjustment happen? There are two ways that you can do it. And when you do it fast, you can see that the two options are, one, you're rooting on the whole foot. You're rooting on the whole foot and then the leg comes in. You're rooting on the whole foot and then the leg comes in. So you spin, boom. At that point, now, when you turn here, that back foot can adjust, okay? The other option is you root on just the heel. You root on just the heel for the whip because the whip needs that rooting. So what you have to do is you then squeeze and then it happens together when you do the whip. And there's a, it feels like a scoot. But what happens is the left leg is coming in for the fall stance and the right leg is, a, a foot is adjusting for that 45 degree angle. So when you do it fast, the butt turn and the whip happen at the same time as a butt turn gives the foot adjustment. And so when I land here, now my, my right foot is at a 45 degree angle for the on push.